Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today, you haven't seen me in ages, I'm sorry. Today though, I have to make a special video because one man has just turned down the shirt, the club of the shirt I'm wearing, Juventus. Lovely shirt, by the way. A new shirt for the next season. Um, have turned down the he's turned down this player has turned down the offer to sign for Juventus, and he has joined Tottenham, and that is Tangai and Don Bellet. So today Tottenham did the business in signing Jack Clark and Tangai and Dombele. Um, Clark has been announced completely, um, and Do and Dombele hasn't yet. By the time you're seeing this, though, it will be most likely out. Um, and it's massive, absolutely massive. These two signings, obviously Jack Clark going back on. We'll start with Jack Clark going back on out on loan to Leeds next season. Um, but yeah, it's, it's still a good signing. I think it's 8.5 million will rise to 13. <sighs> it's just a good, it's just a good signing. Um, uh, what else? I, I don't know what else to say about it. I mean, it's young, good talent. Um, did play really much for Leeds last year. Obviously had that uh, where he collapsed um, back in February. Um, it's five games due to that. So, um... But yeah, I think he's not the one I'm... Obviously, it's a great signing. I'm so pleased with signing him. But the one I really want to focus on is Endombele. Right, now Endombele. All the clubs wanted him. Barcelona, Real Madrid, Tottenham, City. Um, I think, yeah, City were in for him at one point. I think, were, yeah, United were in for him. Juventus were in for him. They are all in for him. And somehow, we've managed to win it. I don't know how, but we have. And that's a statement. I think... That's massive. Um, it's going to help our club next year. Um, obviously, I've got my Premier League predictions coming out soon, so you'll see where I place Tottenham. And it is not top, like I said last year. Um, it is lower down than top. Um, but yeah, I think this squad's nearly complete now. I think all they need is to replace Trippier. I think they need a better right back. Maybe Cancelo. If you're going to probably Ben City, maybe Carl Walker. Cancelo's going there. Why don't he come to us? And Trippier go to Juventus. Do like a little triangle of of um of trades but no i think you know i think oh one sec has and literally just been spurs will announce and in the next few minutes i've just received a text from my dad that um spurs will announce and in the next few minutes oh my goodness it's happening it's actually happening it's actually happening I actually can't believe this. I'm so sorry. I'm. I don't know how true that is. Wow. Um. No, but talk about Ndombele. He's yeah. I think he's going to be a brilliant signing next season. Next season, him, Winks, and Sissoko. It's going to be solid. <sighs> Who knows now? Who knows what can happen? I think we'll win the trophy next year. I think, I'm not going to do my predictions now, but I think we'll win one of them next year. That's all I'm going to say. Um, so obviously my predictions will come in a later video. But I actually can't believe it. Oh my god. Right, I'm going to try and set up the camera so you can see as soon as Tottenham announce this. Okay, so guys, as you can see, I'm currently on Spurs' Twitter. Um, all that we have here is the Jack Clark announcement video, which you can quickly watch now. And then, so I'm hearing it'll be announced in the next few minutes. I'm literally searching all over Twitter just to see. I am literally so excited right now. Um, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, what's going on? I know we're signing him, it's obvious now, but... It's 
someone saying Dombele and um, the other one, uh, Sabios, will be both announced at six. Also, guys, whilst I'm waiting, I'm going to talk about some other transfer news that's gone on today. So, um, people are saying at five o'clock, um, that's in two minutes, so I'm just going to wait. Um, yeah, so guys, um, Maguire today, just whilst we, before we wait for that, Maguire has apparently had Leicester turn down a bid of 70 million from Man United for Harry Maguire. So that's, that's a good bid, if it's true, fair play, but not gonna happen um we just stay at Leicester or go to Man City not United also Arsenal with 40 million for Zaha 40 million what? Zaha's worth at minimum 60 or 70 he's a good player he's a very good player and he's worth 60 or 70 million all all day long okay right it's 50 seconds I'm very um very excited very exciting. I'll back to you in about 30 seconds. Alright, 10 seconds till 5 o'clock. Right, please, 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 Tottenham. Please say I've announced on Don Bello. Oh my god. So I have to listen, but I've heard a lot of people saying this right now. Right, it's 5 o'clock. So I'm just twitter. Let me have a look. Alright guys, I'm just refreshing. Let's just welcome Jack. Welcome Jack. It's all just welcome Jack at the moment. Um, I really don't know what's going on. Right, we're going to head downstairs. I'm going to take you guys downstairs with me because Sky Sports are downstairs. Let's go and have a look. Nothing was announced. <laughs> and they're just talking about Harry Maguire, which is really odd. Very odd. Um, I left my phone up here and I don't know where I've put it. <laughs> um, what the hell? Where did I put my phone? I was actually filming with it and then I put it down. Oh, I don't even care anymore. As long as we sign Don Bella, I don't care. <laughs> oh dear. And in Pat's history, after joining from Lyon for 65 million pounds, Don Bella is a French international and played in central midfield. He has been compared to former star player Moussa Dembele. He signed a five year deal with an option for a six year. So, what kind of player is he then? Well, Dembele, he often runs with the ball from central midfield before playing a forward pass. In fact, he made more forward passes than any other Spurs central midfielder. In addition, he's recorded more triple than Spurs. Oh, he's a more successful than Tottenham's current options in that position. Playing more through balls per game than anyone at Spurs. And Dombele also offers something defensively as well. He wins half of his tackles and on average made nearly five tackles per game last season. Now on the same day, Tottenham have signed uh, one of the most highly rated players in Europe, but one of England's brightest prospects has also arrived at the club. He's 18 years of age, he's Jack Clark, and he's joined up from Leeds. We understand the fee to be an initial 8.5 million. He only made his senior debut last October, went on to make 24 appearances. He's rejoined Leeds in a season-long loan deal, so he's gone back there tonight. Now, it's common for a Premier League club to buy a player from a lower league, and then loan them back. Leeds United confirmed the deal that Jack Clark had joined Tottenham, accompanied with the hashtag by Jack. That was immediately followed by another tweet saying Leeds have pleased to announce the loan signing of Jack Clark with the hashtag hijack. <laughs> Still a bit of having fun today, isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. That's good. Uh, it's having a fun, and this might not be. Mark, no. Last bit, sadness. Guys, I'm going to end the video here because this is what Tottenham have just released.
Come on. Guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Guys, quick message that throughout this video you may have noticed that I was um, saying things such as obviously Kieran Trippier, um, maybe to Juventus. Obviously signed for Atletico Madrid now, that was I think two days ago, three days ago. So um yeah, just to let you know that some of the things I've said in this was filmed two or three weeks ago, or three or four weeks ago actually, sorry. Because some of the things I've said in this aren't exactly true now when you're watching this, but yeah, see you guys later. Peace.